All right, welcome inside Cypress Bay High School as we begin week three of the high school football season. Mike Levine with Wesley Carroll as uh, we uh, have another great game here, Wes. We've done uh, the first two really good, solid weeks of football, and now uh, it's going to be another good one. University School and Cypress Bay. You and I were checking out both of these teams prior to the start of this game, and uh, University School, I'll tell you this, they've got some men on the, on the field. Yeah, they've got a lot of guys, especially on defense. The the middle linebacker going to Notre Dame. Um, you've got athletes all over the field and predominantly on defense, but I, I'm very uh, eager to see Sean White perform, a guy who committed to Auburn, almost 6,000 career passing yards, very strong arm, watched him warm up, looks good, looks solid, anxious to see him play. Well, no, no wonder a quarterback wants to watch a quarterback. I want to see the defensive end, Richard Jurgen. my goodness, 6'4", 230 pounds. We were watching him uh, on the field beforehand and thinking, you know what, uh, 10 years ago plus was a long time for me in high school. Uh, they're growing bigger these days, thankfully. Yeah, he's already got a great build, great size to him. Goes to college, probably put on another 20 pounds. Oh Before boy. you know it, he's probably in the NFL. Yeah, but it, it'll go just uh, uh, that quickly. Now, University School, defending state champions. They now move into 4A. They may be Booker T in the playoffs. You never know. Cypress Bay, they are in rebuilding mode. They lost Alex Montgomery, Geronte Lewis, and Matt Days. So Mark Wandolo, his first game back here this season, uh, they have to do some retooling. Yeah, he's certainly got a challenge ahead of him, but, uh, you know, he's a good coach. He's worked with many different teams. Every year you have a new team, so you just have to find your identity got to roll with it. You, you don't have the luxury of picking up players and, and making trades like they do in, right. the, in the professional ranks, but um, he'll do a good job of getting this team to work. He'll find out where their strong suit is, and he'll definitely excel at some point. The university school is very balanced with Sean White uh, and his passing game, but also how about the running game with Jordan Scarlett, who's got offers pretty much from everybody, including Wes Carroll. I mean, that's, just, <laughs> that's how impressive he is. And Lawan Hunt is the senior. He's a verbal Air Force. I mean, you have two backs that are D1. That makes life a lot easier for a QB. Well, they are predominantly a running team as well. As good as a quarterback that Sean White shows he is, they still predominantly run the ball. Right. And that, of course, is a quarterback's best friend. If he has to win a game, he's more than capable of doing it. All right. Well, uh, that'll do it uh, for here. We'll take a break, step aside, bring kickoff after this. Here. Five minutes to go, first quarter. Here's Sean White, gives to Jordan Scarlett. Side steps one defender at the 40. Now outside the numbers, 45 50, 45 40. It's a foot race to the end zone, 35 30, 20, 15, 10, 5, and a touchdown for Jordan Scarlett. Outside zone play, uh, getting outside. They've done a great job. They've got some speed with this, uh, with this running back. Mike Epstein now in the backfield on this first to goal from the two. Tellison trying to take it himself, a little QB draw following his center. Still no signal from the line judge. And oh, there it is, touchdown. Touchdown for Lucas Tellison, the QB draw. Hey, and a nice drive by Cypress Bay. They're on the board, still unguarded. Nobody touched Jarius Brown, and that's just a little dump-off slant over the middle that goes for a score. A 15-yard hookup from White to Jarius Brown. It makes it 19-7 for... University School, they're moving right to left. Here's the give, a middle run for Scarlett. He's in for a touchdown. Clock run down in the final score, 37-7. University School, an emphatic 30-point win here tonight in Cypress Bay. 